Hey guys, what's going on? This is Matt Phelps with Phelps Fit and the Metabolic Meltdown. I uh, just wanted to talk to you guys really quick about something really delicious, carbs. A lot of my macro clients, you know, they come to me and they, they think that carbs make them fat and carbs are the enemy and it's, it's not true guys. Carbs do not make you fat. Excess calories make you fat. The problem is quite simple really. Carbohydrates are delicious and they're not as filling as protein and fat. So it's super easy to overeat on them, but that is why it is so important to be aware of how much you are eating when you eat food so that you can control your intake, lose body fat, feel good, optimize hormone levels, and get into the best shape of your life. You don't want to eat too few carbohydrates that will really mess with your hormones. Um, you won't have energy to get through workouts if you're working out intensely as you should be and you know You're just gonna feel like crap. So it'll back you up. You know your digestion will be off So, you know low-carb diets are a good quick fix, but that's all they are. They're a quick fix That's not a lifestyle. No one's gonna eat a low-carb diet for life nor should they for optimal balance and health when you're including carbs and choosing your diet you know, a lot of women and smaller men, it's not that processed carbs are that much worse for you than, than non-processed carbs. So I say processed carbs, anything crunchy like rice cakes, cereal, you know, baked lays, all that stuff, as opposed to rice, sweet potatoes, potatoes, oatmeal. It's just that oatmeal is gonna give you so much bang for your buck than vanilla checks. Believe me, I love vanilla checks, but I could eat a thousand calories vanilla checks. If I had a thousand calories of oatmeal, I'd be sick. So it's very important not to be restrictive in your dieting. You want to include a variety of carb sources. Work in a little bit of the carbs that you enjoy. Um, don't include trigger carbs that are going to cause you to overeat because you can't control yourself. Find ones that you can be moderate with. You know, you going back to that vanilla checks example for me, vanilla checks, I stay away from that when I'm dieting, but I will include some chocolate. I can control myself with chocolate. I am a cereal fiend, so I need to stay away from that. But find stuff that works for you. But my take home message is pasta is not necessarily gonna make you any more fat than potatoes. If you eat any food in excess, it will cause you to gain body fat, okay? Um, you could have a thousand calories of protein and pop darts and you'd lose fat. Is that healthy or is that optimal? Of course not, but it's possible. And when we're talking about losing body fat, it's important to realize we're not always talking about optimizing your health and wellness. So keep that in mind, guys. My take home message to you with this video, carbs are carbs. Uh, you know, non stop processed whole food carbs will definitely be more filling and give you more bang for your buck and that will cause you to stay on your diet and, and get the results you want. But include some of the fun stuff in moderation. This is Matt Phelps with Phelps Fit. Enjoy those carbs. <music>